Welcome back to the channel guys. How you doing? Hope everyone's having a great day. I have come out to Highland Park in Coomera. Just have a couple of hours spare and thought I'd come and see if I can catch a giant tilapia. This lake is pretty infested with them. But uh, first, health and safety message on the side of my face. I'm not sure if I'm getting that. Two spots on my cheeks, skin cancers. Had them frozen off this week. Slip, slop, slap, people. Uh, look after your skin. The sun can be cruel. Uh, so yeah, in here we got spangle perch, silver perch, tilapia, some gudgeons, and a bunch of other little tiny invasives. So uh, this line here, I've got bread set on that one, and I've got the bamboo pole here. So we are going to load up the bamboo pole with a worm. Got a container of uh, big juicy worms here. Look at that one. That one is going on first. And here we go. Worm is set on the hook. Let's get it out there. Let's see what we can get today. Big tilapia or a silver perch would be nice. We haven't caught many silver perch on this channel. It would be nice to get something a little different for you guys. Oh, here we go, guys. Here we go. We have got... Oh! Holy macaroni. Guys, that is an absolute stonker of a tilapia. <laughs> Holy macaroni. Okay, this is going to be difficult to pull in. Whoa, he is an absolute monster. Whoa. Look at that. That is a good one. That is an epic tilapia. Wow. He has got to be, I'm guessing, about uh, two kilos. That is a big, big fish. Wow. Look at that. <laughs> On the bamboo. That's so awesome. And uh, yeah, live worm. Live worm. So uh, we're going to see if we can get our hook back. Wow. How good was that tilapia? It was an absolute monster. So I've rebaited up. And I uh, got the hooks back in the water. Fingers crossed we'll get another one. But yeah, he is an absolute weapon of a fish. Massive, massive tilapia. All right. So, so far, we've caught that one monster tilapia. And we haven't got anything else yet. We have had a couple of bites. Something is nibbling on the bamboo. Oh, and we've done our bait. Let's get some more worms. So these are the worms that I grow in my worm farm that I got from Bunnings. So I don't have to buy bait anytime I want to go fishing. I've got a nice healthy supply of worms. So I was going to go back fishing at some of my uh, favorite little carp and uh, koi fishing spots today, but I got there only to find that because of the um, tremendous amount of rain that we've had, that this, my fishing spots are completely grassed over. Like we're talking grass almost two meters high and really, really thick. 
So, you know, that's great brown snake territory, so I'm not about to start going through any of that stuff. We are baited up again. Let's see how we go. So yeah, as I was saying, my favorite fishing spots have uh, been completely overgrown by long, thick, oh, that was a good bite. That was a good bite. I think that was a spangled perch then, guys. So yeah, I think next time when I go to, there we go, there we go, oh, come on. When I go back to the uh, carp spot, I think I'll have to take my weed whacker and uh, carve a pathway through. Come on. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Here, oh! That was a tilapia. It was not a spangle perch. There's another big tilly down there. Back in the water. We just missed something big and... Oh, look at that. Little spangle perch, guys. And we've still got our bait, so uh, I can uh, reuse that hook. Let me just get this little fella off the line. So yeah, if you've uh, watched this channel before, you know that these guys are natives and uh, we love them very much and he will be released. So I just got to get the hook out. This little fella can be on his way. There he goes. So, got my bait still. Alrighty, this will be the last cast of today. And just like that, we got a spangle perch. So, yeah. Thanks for uh, joining me guys. We've caught about a dozen of these little fellas and that monster two kilo tilapia. So yeah, great day and thanks for joining.